Hi, this is Rachel. Welcome to my channel. Today, I'm gonna to talk about Crossbar.io. Crossbar.io is an open source networking platform for distributed and microservice architecture. It is a very powerful tool. With Crossbar.io, you can create distributed multi-language applications, while components communicate use pub and sub and RPCs. Today, I will demonstrate how to install crossbar.io on your Mac computer. After that, I will show you an example. Hope you will like it. In the future, I will share more knowledge around crossbar.io with you guys. If you like my channel, please subscribe. We can install crossbar.io on various environments. The best way, I think, is to use Docker. And today I'm going to show you how to directly install crossbar.io on Mac. OK, if you click that link, it will take you to the site for installation on Mac OS. There are two ways for setup. One is a setup by using C Python. The other is using PyPy. So I will show you how to set up by using PyPy. Open up terminal and follow the instruction which are on the website. Install PyPy. And then you're going to install the environment, virtual environment. After that, you will need to create a PyPy virtual environment in the directory. I will just follow that. Then finally, you will go to the path and start working in that virtual environment. OK, it's time to install crossbar.io. And you will use the pipe install. Finally, we are going to check if crossbar is installed by using crossbar version. Great, it shows crossbar has been successfully installed. You can clearly see crossbar.io's version number and the Python's version number and those details. Now it's the time to show you an example. What I'm going to show you is a, a demo of dashboard. So that example is a very good one and interesting one, which you can easily find from the demo side. So it will be easy to find the source code from GitHub. This is the GitHub website you will be able to download the source code from this side to your local environment. Today, I want to talk too much about Git. I assume you already know. I'm now getting into the directory and show you how the demo looks like.
Okay. Once you get to the dashboard directory, you are gonna to run the course bar start. After some time, it shows that crossbar.io is running. See, this contains a lot of details. It's about the, the router worker and so what's the status of those requests. So let's go to the website and check it. Okay. Wait a second. Yeah. You will be able to see the demo website which shows the dashboard. It asks you to open a controller. On the controller, you can click and start to running the controller to send the requests. And you can stop it. That's it. On the terminal, you can see more information around the requests. That's the end of today's tutorial. I hope you like it. If you like it, please do subscribe my channel. I will share more interesting technology with you guys in the future. Thank you for watching.